Hello everyone. This tutorial will cover how to choose a topic for an argumentative research paper. The first thing I would do is start with a brainstorm. If you're completely drawing a blank on what you might want to write about, this brainstorming activity can help you come up with some ideas. Just fill in the blanks you see here on the screen. The library also has databases that can be helpful for helping you come up with topic ideas, and those include Opposing Viewpoints and SIRS. The news and current events can also be a good place to look. If you'd like to search the library databases for topic ideas, you'll need to go to the library's homepage and click on Find Articles and Databases. I'm going to start by showing you Opposing Viewpoints. Under the A to Z database list, all of the databases are listed in alphabetical order. Opposing Viewpoints has topic ideas on a wide variety of topics. As I mentioned before, current events are a good place to find ideas. Up here at the top of the screen, in the scroll bar, you can see some current events that you could make arguments about. Scrolling down a bit more, You'll see broad topics like energy and environmentalism, law and politics, national debate topics. Click on view all to see narrower topics under these very broad disciplines. So I clicked on science, technology, and ethics. And we have a very long list of possible topics. Let's say you're interested in cloning. Clicking on the cloning topic will give you an overview. Okay, so up here at the top next to the cat picture, if you click on view more, this is an overview of the topic of cloning and this is a good place to do some background research if you're not really familiar with the topic. Read through this, you'll get some ideas for some keywords and maybe some ideas for ways that you can develop a research question. You also have the option of looking at viewpoints. These are all arguments that you could make about cloning. You can click on one of the arguments and do note that this is just uh, one side of the coin. It'll give you some ideas to consider, um, some questions to consider, and introduce you to the debate on whatever topic you've clicked on. SIRS is quite similar. Up at the top of the screen in SIRS, you have the most popular issues in the database. They call these ProCon leading issues. You can click on view all issues to see every issue listed in this database, or you can scroll down and look at a broad topic that you're interested in. So if you look at school, family, and youth, say you're interested in homeschooling, much like opposing viewpoints, that will bring you to a topic page, and it gives you a research question. Does the government have the right to monitor homeschooling? And we have an overview of the topic and viewpoints. So you just have a point and a counterpoint. So viewpoint one is many, many parents are unqualified to teach, and viewpoint two is parents should be able to decide how to educate their own children. And then below each viewpoint, these blue links are articles that support each side of the issue. Many of these topics are quite broad, so you'll want to think about ways that you can narrow them down. You can come up with ways to narrow a topic down through a process called background research. Background research is when you read about your topic on the web and then online encyclopedia, so even somewhere like Wikipedia, and you take note of the lingo, jargon, and keywords that are associated with the topic of interest. These aren't sources for your paper, they're just a way to get ideas on how you can develop a research question. So for example, if you are interested in writing about driverless cars, you might do some background research and arrive at this research question. 
while driverless cars allow senior citizens greater freedom to live on their own. So when you're looking for a topic, always keep thinking, what's the question I have about this topic? How can I narrow this down and come up with a research question that's appropriate for the paper length I've been assigned? If at any point in the research process you have questions about coming up with the topic, feel free to contact a librarian. You can do so through the Ask a Librarian link on the library's homepage. Click on that and you'll see the number where you can text us, call us, schedule one-on-one -on -one help, which you can do in person or via Skype, or use the chat box. Good luck!